Alright, welcome to my modded very first run of Aliens Colonial Marines. I am using the AMC Overhaul version 6 mod. And we'll be doing a campaign run. And I think I'll be doing a soldier run. suffered immense casualties on LV-426 and requests immediate assistance aboard the USS Sulaco. Of the survivors, myself, two human females, one of which is a child, and a damaged synthetic. Consider all Colonial Marines dispatched to LV-426 to be KIA. Repeat, all Marines dispatched to LV-426 were KIA. Rise and shine, Marines. This isn't a drill, and you aren't in Kansas anymore. On your feet, Marines. For any new recruits, I'm Captain Cruz, and you are my crew on the USS Sephora. We responded to a distress call sent out 17 weeks ago from the USS Sulaco. Rhino 23 went in first and encountered heavy resistance. You are the last of the battalion to get popped out of cryo. So I don't want to hear any bitching because we let you lugheads sleep in late. Get combat ready, and I'll see you in the hangar in 20 mics. Name and rank? Corporal Christopher Winter, 118th Battalion aboard the USS Sephora. Corporal Winter, I'm sending in Rhino 2 1 to reinforce 2 3. How are you feeling, kid? I'm feeling good, Captain. But I'm worried about 2 3. That's good, because I'm sending you in to catch up with Rhino 2 1. They're trying to get the Sulaco flight recorder so we can see who caused this. Sir, what happened in there? Let me shit the bed. Attention, chicks and dicks of the USS Sephora! As of right this second, Rhino 2-1 and Rhino 2-3 are fighting to get a hold of the situation we're in. We don't leave Marines behind. Over the next two hours, we're gonna send a series of dropships over to aid with Kazavak on the USS Sulaco. Sir, the Sulaco was reported last seen over Fury 161. How is it back over this planet? Lieutenant Reed, thanks for the interruption. We don't know how that boat got back here. Right now, we're worried about what's killing our Marines in there. This is a liquid situation. Information to follow as it comes online. Ready up. Good hunting, Marines. Oorah to Ash! Oorah! Listen up. What I need right now is information. No heroics, no bullshit. I need you to be my eyes in there. Report back anything you see so I know what I'm up against. Roger that. Tell Rhino 2-1 I'm en route to their location. All right, so I guess we are up and running. And if you happen to enjoy this series, or this channel, I would love to be dropped a sub or a like. And having said that, first death confirmed. So I was actually trying to <laughs> find out if I had a flashlight, but F was 
grenades. But this is kind of dark, isn't it, though? Target tracking in progress. Latitude coordinates tracking. Longitude coordinates tracking. Sulaco. Press E to push button. Tutorial. Objects in the world that you can interact with will display a blue shimmering highlight. To interact with one, approach and press E when prompted. For example, press E to use the analog switch. To review your current objectives. Uh, I think it's the... Yeah. Remember the location of your current obje uh, objective. Can we see any motion tracker? Oh, okay. So it's tab. Mission one distress. Special projects, zero out of three dog tags found, zero out of one audio logs found, zero out of one legendary weapon found, Hicks shotgun. Shit point reached. Winner, what the hell just happened in there? Raider 6-5, are you in the air yet? Explosive decompression in the Sulaco. This is Raider 6-5. The umbilical is venting Atmo into the black. Looks dicey, sir. Dicey? Raider, I need grown-up words. You have 20 minutes before a total collapse. Shut it down. Winner, you heard the lady. Get to the other side and we're shutting it down. Continuing on to the Sulaco. Winner out. from Rhino 2-1. Negative 2-1. That explosion jacked the airlock on our end. We cannot use the umbilical without risking more lives. Sit tight and stabilize our Marines. 2-1, what is the status of 2-3? Winner. It looks like he sent you over into this mess as well. Pull up your motion tracker. Tell me what you see. Press Q to bring up your motion tracker. If you can't, continuously scan a 180 phone in front of you. Solid blips represent unknown or hostile moving objects, while hollow blips represent allied units. Flashing arrows at the bottom of the display warn of movement behind you. A hex icon represents the location of your current objective. Got you two here, and I'm reading 2 3 to the south, beyond the hangar, engineering perhaps. They moving? No. Wait. I got an unidentified signal. Something's moving. Damn it. Sephora actual. It sounds like 2 3 are holding position. Or they're down. We're reading unidentified movement in their area. They could be under attack. All right. Winner and I are going to. Damn it. Sephora actual. I'm heading into rendezvous with 2-3. Remember what I said about heroics, kid. Actual out. Tanaka. Paluski. Hernandez. Romero. And Tolentino. And O'Reilly. Now, there we go. So, we have a flashlight. Can we pick these up? I don't think we can. Locate the missing marines.
Orman? Apone? Oh, tutorial. You can use your flashlight to illuminate the immediate environment. Press T to toggle your flashlight on and off. Yeah. And I rebound that. It was X to begin with. X. Dietrich, Vasquez, and Hudson. So, it's basically the Marines from Aliens, second movie. Very cool. Looks like ejected cryo tubes. Hell of a way to wake up. You can actually close it. All right. We got a moving. Well, had. If a door has a flashing red light, it can be cut open or welded shut. Press E to use your welder. This process takes some time and leaves you completely vulnerable to enemy attack. Oh, good. Doors with a solid red light are locked and cannot be opened. And then it turns to green. Holy shit. Are you seeing this, Captain? No, is that a helmet? I think it is. Where am I? Where am I? Winner! Grab, grab your torch. Cut me the hell out of here. Yeah! 
Kill the Xeno. Don't worry about me. Go kill that thing. All right. Oh, nice. A camera. Yeah, someone's been taking pictures of him getting yeah oh your health bar is divided into segments so long as a segment is completely lost it will regenerate over time damage by the xenos acid will stop your health from regenerating for a few moments pick up med packs to restore lost health segments and collect armor for an additional layer of defense That's standard fare, more or less. Oh, that's a face hugger. Oh, so that's not like uh, flashing, so I guess this one is just perma locked. We have our first confirmed kill. Yeah. Let's uh, help our buddy out. This is winter. I've located keys from Rhino 23. There's some bodies down here, but some are missing. There are one or two Marines missing from Rhino 23. They're all dead. Gone. He's gone. Sit tight. I got you, buddy. Winter, regroup what's left. Get him back to the hangar and the rest of 2 1. Do not engage. This is keys from 2 3, sir. Our mission was to recover the flight data from the Salon. I gave you that mission, and it's over. Now regroup and come- We have to know what caused this. The flight recorder can get us that, with all due respect- Sir, my respect. squad means you shut your goddamn mouth and follow your orders. Actual out. Hell with the orders. The flight wreck isn't too far from here. We grab it, link up with Rhino 2-1. O'Neal, you still there? Damn. Are you guys on the way back? No. You gotta buy us ten minutes to grab the flight wreck. Our Marines aren't gonna die for nothing. You've got five to get that recorder and get back here. Keep an eye out for Bella Keys. Urata Ashes Marine. We'll keep an eye out. Thanks, O'Neill. Thanks for doing this, Winner. Don't think. Just shoot. Alright, can I read now? Your pulse rifle has an under barrel weapon. Grip the pulse rifle and press F to fire its under our weapon. Yeah, we found out the <laughs> the hard way.
We got some intense music playing for some reason right now. In route, two mics to you. Affirmative winner, just save the high fives for the bedroom. Get your ass back here. There's no way the flight wreck didn't tape the assholes that did it to the Sulaco. If we make it back with this thing, who knows what we'll find on it. like a balloon. Yeah, he was not dead. Shit's getting scary! Very true. Your location in one mic. No, he won't. Old loader. On the dropship! Watch this! Grenada! Keys, wait! Are you out of your damn mind? Get to the umbilical!
2-1, pack it up and let's move! Flatwreck is en route to the Sephora. We did it, guys! Rhino team, move, move, move! We lost the flight, Rick. Keys. Keys had the recorder on him. That was all for nothing. Well, we're not dead. So, you know, there's that. This is Sephora Actual. 2-1, can you read me? What just happened in the umbilical? Actual, I got solid copy. We lost Keys. Pretty sure something exploded from his chest. Is Winner with you? Yes, sir. Any thoughts on the exploding chest issue? All of our Cheyenne-class birds en route to provide Kazavak and ground support. That's almost 80 Marines en route, and we gotta get them somewhere to land. The hangar's out of commission, but we got room in the cargo bays. Understood. We are heading to the cargo bay. Two one out. Something's not right. Follow me. I will definitely follow him, but we'll do it in the next part. Thank you for watching part one of my first ever Let's Play of Alien Colonial Marines modded version. I hope you had as much fun as I had. I would love to if you dropped a sub or a like, and if I saw you again in the next video. But for now, it is time to say bye-bye.